Hey yo, it's Dave -O. What's going on, everybody? Now, in today's video, I want to talk to you about something. I want to talk to you about farming, right? Uh, you probably got a team full of like what? Blue Demon Meliodas, uh, Green Coin Shop Bond, uh, this Red Gother right here, and uh, what? I don't know what else you're running. I don't know. Maybe you're running another AOE. I don't know. I don't know what you got. Maybe you got a coin shop Merlin, you're trying to get everybody ultimates. You know, you know, you got a, a good a whole bunch of AoEs, but how's it right here, right? He's my main farming unit, right? So I figured I'm like, huh. When I use this team, this is like, you know, this is my show off team. I got 150 CP, you know, it's just like oh, he's like a oh he's like a whale, so he has over 150 K C P. No, I'm not a whale. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> I just like prioritize Houser. Houser is my pride and joy. So I want to talk to you about. See, he has like what? 10k attack. And uh, we're not really worried about HP and defense. Who cares? I'm talking about farming. I'm talking about hitting hard. So let's hop in. Let's look at how hard Houser hits. And I think I may have cracked the code when it comes to farming. Now, don't laugh at me when I get to my second team. I'm going to just, just, just look at this one as a baseline, right? So. We want to get Houser his level three this card, right? But we're gonna do this one. And we're gonna try and get him an ultimate. So we can see how hard this ultimate actually hits the final phase and we can see how hard that um level three card we have down there hits, right? See? Now we wanna get him an ultimate, huh? So we gotta do that. Let's get these other cards out of the way. This. Hopefully this doesn't kill him. But if it does, I don't care. We'll still stall. But the ultimate goal is just get an ultimate and have that level three card down there untouched. Okay, we finished him off. That's the product of having a 150 C 150 K C B team. So that's a that's hard to say. That's a tongue twister for me. All right. So we're fighting these three. We need one more card until he gets his ultimate. Let's just. Do that. Get that out of the way. Wait, well, everybody. Everybody getting. Everybody's getting the ultimate right now. <laughs> oh well. So, Houser. Yep. Yeah, everybody gets an ultimate. All right. Let's see how hard Houser hits with his ultimate and then with his level three card. All right. Ultimate first, right? Because they're gonna survive. But then the level three card is gonna kill them. So we'll do this and then we'll just do that. Whatever. All right. Houser hits. All right, 271k. You saw that, right? <laughs> 271k. That's a max SA Hauser, and then he hits for 92k. 92k on a level three card, right? Remember those. Remember it. Around 200k ultimate, and under 100k level three card. All right. Now we're gonna go back in. Now don't laugh. But this team right here is proven to me to make Houser hit so hard, right? All right, you got Death Pierce, who like lowers um, enemies' crit resistance and crit defense, right, by 30%, right? So you can like hit harder. And then this SR Hendrickson, right? He gives you, he gives allies more penetration. However, like many cards the whole team uses, right? So if you use like 10 cards, right? you'll get his like max passive and I think his passive is like I don't know it, it like gives everybody like two times like the penetration the penetration rate <laughs> and this is Travis right here he um his passive is the higher his all gauge is uh everybody on a team penetration rate doubles right so that's freaking insane that's gonna make Hauser hit hard and they're all humans so they fall under Hauser's um passive so we're gonna hop in, even though we were under 100k CP, we're still gonna win. And we're gonna see how hard Hauser hits now. Now these SR cards, I'm going through my box and I'm waking in every single unit to UR and I'm like, and I'm becoming enlightened. <laughs> these cards are just crazy for like overall like team like support. Uh, we can just do this. Let's try and get Hauser level three. Now, Hendrickson may die, but we he can heal, so I think we're pretty much good. All right, yeah, we got a lot of heals. Now we do. If you're done attacking, please do this. 
this, and we can move that level three card. He got his ultimate, but we can use Henderson's ult. Don't use Dreyfus's ult, because you want <laughs> you want to keep Dreyfus's ult because when he has max ult gauge, everybody can hit their hardest, right? Okay, we can get a. Looks like we can get a freaking level three heal. I think we can heal right up. All right. Oh, he actually killed somebody. That's pretty cool. I think he's max SA too. Uh, we're gonna heal because we don't want to die. We want Dreyfus to get his ultimate. All right, beautiful. We got Hauser's level three card. If we can survive this, he has his ultimate, and then we have Dreyfus get his max ult gauge. And hopefully, we can survive. Yeah, we, we got it. This is the one person left. All right, Dreyfus has his old gauge max. Now what we want to do is just get this trash out of the way. All right, paying attention. <laughs> we used how many cards? Uh, I don't know if we used ten cards for for um, Hendrickson's max passive. But either way, we got Dreyfus's max old gauge. Now everybody else's penetration rate is doubled, right? All right. Cool. Y'all pay attention, y'all still with me. Hold on there, hold on. Watch. Look at this damage. Look. We're gonna do this, then this, then who cares? Whatever. Watch. Boom. Three over 300 k And then this level three card. Boom. Over 200 k We didn't even get over like nearly a hundred K on the first run. This is crazy. This is gonna be my new main farming team. Once I get these guys up and they're absolute monsters, I can one shot any like PVE event in the game. So that's it for today's video, you guys. Let me know what teams you run for farming. Either it could be a team that you run like while you're sleeping and you can just like auto farm like um, XP potions or just like what, chest or gear over, I don't know, whatever you farm when you're not paying attention, when you're not actually trying, you know, like PvP content or raids, whatever you're farming, when you're not, when you're passive and not looking, tell me, what do you run? Because this is going to be my new, <laughs> my new PvE farming team. You saw how hard hard to hit. You saw, the, you saw the increased attack. Tell me, tell me, is it, is it worth running a, a coin shop bond and a, uh, a blue Meliodas on the same team who don't give each other's like who don't like feed off each other's passive if you have a whole team that feed off each other's passive you won you GG te team building one on one I mean bro you saw it right here in this video it's proof so anyway you guys that's it for today's video leave a like if you actually enjoyed this video and subscribe if you're new to your boy help your boy out we're still on the road to 50 subscribers and anyway you guys Make sure, oh yeah, make sure to let me know what team you run. And I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video. Alright, peace.